Out to Deputy Pauline Tully. Um, Minister, I wish to support the bill, but while supporting this bill, there are a couple of things I am a little bit concerned about. The first one is if a parent or a guardian or, or a grandparent approaches a teacher or member of school personnel to try and influence grades, but does so without the knowledge or the consent of the pupil, I don't think that the pupil should be held responsible or accountable, and I believe a fine should be imposed on said person rather than the student being denied a result. Uh, a result. And I just want to point out to Deputy O'Reardon that Labour voted in favour of the Sinn Féin amendment on this issue in Shannon's Erin. And that my colleague Deputy O'Leary and Sinn Féin, we are not condoning canvassing in any shape or form. We just think it would be unfair to punish a student if they had no hand, act or part in it. Uh, I would also have some concerns about the exact form of standardisation that will be used and fear that certain schools may be, again be discriminated against, as we found that happened last year. So I think everyone just wants the system to be fair and transparent for all concerned. I do wish to recognise the huge contribution that both teachers and students have made to education last year and in the first three months of this year. Teaching online and learning online proved to be very difficult, but I have to commend all involved for the huge effort that they made to make it work. Many have spoken to would acknowledge they much, much rather be in the classroom, so I think the day technology replaces humans as teachers is thankfully unforeseen. Um, going with the combination of examinations and accredited grades was the right option. Um, it was the option most favoured by the students themselves, and it allows the many students who wish to sit the exams to do so, but it also caters for those who found it extremely difficult to learn at home where circumstances may not have been conducive to doing so, for various reasons, maybe access to technology or to decent broadband. I think the isolation of learning at home without the support of classmates proved to be the greatest challenge, and I hope that we don't have to resort to that again in the future. Thank you. Thank you very much, Deputy. Now, Deputy Gary.